I believe you've got pretty much a portfolio career of yourself. Can you tell us a bit about what that entails? Yeah, I mean, actually, uh, although I've, I've sort of um, I've started recommending a portfolio to career to people as something to, to aim to build themselves, for me, it's something that's ended up happening almost by accident. I've sort of um, been making my career up as I go along. Um, I, I was working full time in a newsroom uh, until uh, October in 2009, and then I, I quit my job to move to London and to, to work as a freelancer, not really with any kind of particular plan. Plan. Um, but what's ended up happening is um, just through, as I say, entirely by accident, sort of, I've ended up kind of building this portfolio career. So um, on, on one hand, I'm, I'm a lecturer. I, I, I lecture in, in video journalism at uh, Kingston University uh, in London. Um, I also work as a video journalist on a freelance basis for agencies and also online uh, sites like VJ Movement. And make pieces for them. I've done some print journalism um, for people at the Big Issue um, since leaving as well. Um, and on top of that, I blog um, and I'm also selling information products, so ebooks um, and that type of thing. Um, and another stuff which I kind of do for free, like running the Future of News Meetup group, which is a monthly kind of meetup for journalists in London. Um, all those kind of things all together have kind of formed, as I say, completely by accident, this kind of portfolio career.